We begin with breaking news from the South Side tonight where police shot two suspected car thieves. Skycam 9 was over the scene in Inglewood when it happened just after 5 o'clock. WGN's Dana Rebick is following developments. She's joining us live from the scene. Dana. And we did get an update from Chicago police a short time ago. We know that one officer was injured during this incident. And as you mentioned, two suspects shot by a police officer uh, earlier tonight. Again, this happened just after 5 o'clock p.m. All three of these individuals, the officer and the two suspects, in stable condition with non-life-threatening injuries. Now, this started at 71st and Green in Inglewood. Chicago police say a major auto theft task force officer spotted a vehicle that had been reported stolen with two people inside. That officer tried to approach the car, but then the offenders tried to get away. Two occupants of that vehicle started the vehicle and proceeded to strike that uh, officer. That officer was drugged a short distance, at which time the officers, one of the officers uh, fired their weapon into the vehicle, striking both of the occupants. At that point, the suspects crashed that vehicle. They were taken to the University of Chicago Hospital. Police say one was shot in the arm, the other in the wrist, again, both in stable condition. The officer who was dragged was taken to Advocate Christ Hospital and we're told is doing okay. A police uh, spokesman says they did confiscate a gun from that stolen vehicle. Police did not give a description of that car, though, or uh, the names or ages of these offenders or their descriptions. Both the auto task force and beat officer will be placed on a 30 day administrative leave as COPA investigates. Live in Inglewood, Dana Revick, WGN News.